with the break in between storms. Highway 50 is clear for now. But some secondary streets in Pollock Pines still need attention. Oh, it's going heavy, slow, you know, long, but it's going. It's been going nonstop for private plow contractor Adrian Bramvilla. It's been going for quite a while, you know, a couple, couple days, but get a couple hours of sleep and come back, hit it again, do some sanding, keep people safe and keep going. And while Bramvilla takes care of clearing commercial properties. It seems like it goes in like seven, eight year kind of cycles. You know, every cycle we just get hammered up here. Justin Stockwell is looking out for the elderly, shoveling the driveway of a stranger. Yeah, I actually met her this morning. Her name's Vanda, sweet little old lady. And um, yeah, like I said, she's at the, uh, she comes to the church for firewood. We're just stocking up for the next storm. Yeah. Yeah. Others ventured out to fill their fridge with their favorite snacks. Soda, uh, chips, and other snacks. All the carts are were gone when I got here. <laughs> Diane Bistrom took a trip to the grocery store to make sure her pup, Ghost the Great Pyrenees, is stocked up with his snacks. Yeah, I ran out of his hot dogs. And during this break, Pollock Pines is ready if another storm dumps more snow next week. Sign me up, more than happy to same time, same place next week. Yeah, don't put those shovels away just yet. So we did check with Caltrans and earlier today it had lifted all chain controls on Highway 50, but within the past hour, those chain controls are in place between Kybers and Myers. That stretch there can get a little dicey as we have seen even in the storms this past week. Reporting live in Pollock Pines, Michelle Bandur, KCRA 3 News.